The other morning, I awoke with angst and insecurity. Commitments were mounting, and I didn't know how the day was going to go. My kids were still sleeping, so I went downstairs to pray. And as I watched the sky brighten with the rising sun, I thought of three biblical characters, Moses, Gideon, and Mary. Now, initially the thought seemed random, yet I soon recalled a striking similarity. When called by God, they were overwhelmed by their own sense of insecurity and fear. Do you remember? Moses, he said, who am I? I can't speak. And Gideon said, how can I save Israel? I'm the weakest. And Mary, she said, how can I birth the Christ? I'm a virgin. These questions made them want to run away. But then another similarity came to my mind, not regarding their response to God, but regarding God's response to them. See, God did not respond with a list of their strengths. In fact, God said nothing about their ability, nothing. He assured them with something far greater, something that would carry them through the challenges to come. To Moses, Gideon, and Mary, God said this. He said, I will be with you. And did you know that this same promise echoes to you and me? Hebrews 13.5 says, I will never leave you or forsake you. The answer to insecurity is never our sufficiency. The answer to insecurity is His sufficiency, His presence with us. Are you overwhelmed? Are you discouraged? Are the internal voices overshadowing the voice of the Almighty? Today, rather than straining to succeed, let your soul settle with this promise. God is with you. Thank you.